what is up all my dumpster peeps Whew. I'm just leaving work slow night guys A slow night those are Beth's headlights behind me because y'all know what we're doing by now right yeah we're gonna go do some dumpster diving so this day of the week is the day of the week that the Dollar General, which I call the Renews It Dollar General. I don't know why I always do this. I'm always doing this. Why am I doing that? Tell me to stop it. <laughs> I annoy myself when I edit. I'm like, stop doing that, Shannon. What was I saying? Oh, I call it the Renews It Dollar General because I got cases upon cases of Renews It's from that dumpster like a year or two ago. But I'm always getting cases of stuff from that dumpster. Sorry for the bumps, guys. I mean, it is crazy how much they throw away at this Dollar General. I am hoping there's stuff in the dumpster because I don't really have a backup plan <laughs> if there's not stuff in the dumpster. I guess if there's not, then I'm just going to have to go check other dumpsters. Yeah. So that's what we're doing. And um, yeah, so I'm going to shut up and... <laughs> Let's go jump in some dumpsters on this gorgeous, beautiful night. It is 65 degrees out. I mean, I am so excited about warm weather. Y'all don't even understand because I am not a cold weather person. All right, let's go jump in some dumpsters. All right, guys, we're at the DG. Dang it. This one hasn't given up the goods in so long. All right, we're going to go check a couple other places and hopefully we'll have some luck there. Sorry for the dirty windshield. Office Depot. Office Depot map. Office map. Office Depot. Alright guys, so there's a gorgeous desk in here. Look at this. Yeah, it's really nice. I'm not messing with that because who knows if all the pieces are here. She has like, like a leather. leather top. Yeah. So we're just going to get, there's some stuff in the back and some stuff in the bags. Ooh, okay. Don't fall Let's see what we got. Alright, we got lots of planners. But the desk is on top of it. Dang it, no one likes stuck in this box. Oh, okay, there's tons of planners. Okay, get out of the box, Shannon. <laughs> I'm stuck. All the planners under it. They tried to hide it. We'll get them. We'll get them. 2020. Boxes. 2020. Dang it! To 2021. Oh, are they all? Damn it! I just did all that work. <laughs> Hopefully there's some. 2020. 2020. Man! Why do they start at July, though? July, July 2020, 2020 hasn't happened yet. Yeah, we're in 2021. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Uh, that's, I forget to get all the time. <laughs> I thought it was 2019 the other day. Did you really? Yeah, I wrote 2019. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Only two oh, years here we behind. go, 2021. There we there go. Here we go. Oh wait, no, it's 20. Oh, um, 220. <laughs> oh. Come on, Shannon, use your brain. They're oh. all 2020 to 2021. Are they all planners? Yeah, yeah they, they do. They have all the dates. That sucks. There were some chips in that bag we threw out. Got some Doritos. Cool Ranch. That's about it. Just filled with all those planners. That sucks. sucks. Yeah, that really sucks. I mean, I, people are like, you can still use them. Well, but yeah, they're about. Nobody buys them and then I get stuck with them. It was like the end of 2020 or right. something. Right, I would take them then, but bags of Korean Doritos. <laughs> so, <laughs> we got three bags of Korean Doritos so far. That's it. <laughs> so, here's the dealio. We checked all the dumpsters out in this town, and of course, there was nothing. But then we checked the CVS, and wouldn't you know it? There, so far, all I could see, like I literally just peeked my head in super quick. There is a ton of like the small bottles of Dr. Pepper cream soda. We didn't even open the dumpster the whole way. We just peeked our head in. And she said there was stuff on the other side too, but she couldn't really tell what it was because we had to be fast because they're still open. 
So we were like, we'll just come back. So we went and checked every other dumpster. There is nothing anywhere. So we're heading back now. I had to come and bring her back to her car so that we could leave straight from there. We're gonna go back now. Hopefully the manager is gone because they were still there. And um, that way we can take our time filming and it won't be all over the place. But this is the last dumpster we're checking. So, I mean, I hope there's more than just four bottles of Dr. Pepper cream soda. <laughs> Or this is gonna suck. But we are going out diving tomorrow night, so of course I will just carry this video over until tomorrow. That's CVS right there. And the manager's car is still there. Just hanging out, hoping that these things flying above our head and making noise aren't bats. <laughs> and waiting for the manager to leave. So we're literally staking out CVS's dumpster. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna think we're staking out the, the pharmacy to rob it, but really, we just want their trash. So, hopefully, they leave soon because I'm really not trying to hang out here all freaking night. So, if Beth has to leave to pick up her mom, then I'm just gonna do it by myself and I'll put you guys on my car. So, all right, guys, I'm just going for it. They're still here, I don't care, I'm not waiting any longer. but I had to be fast because I don't know if the manager is still there or what. We sat here and staked this dumpster out for like 40 minutes. Welcome back to yet another day of dumpster diving because last night sucked donkey balls. <laughs> Let's just be serious peeps. That was a horrible Oh my goodness, those planners, oh, those planners broke my heart. And I know a lot of you guys are gonna be like, but you can still do stuff with them. Yes, if you're like a crafter or whatever, or even a teacher, I'm sure you could do stuff with them. I just don't have the room, guys, I don't. And I don't wanna donate a bunch of planners that nobody can do anything with unless they're like, don't mind having like the wrong year. <laughs> I mean, I don't, you know, to each their own. I, I can only save so much. You know what I mean? I'm more about saving the food and the clothing, stuff like that to help out people that are in need. I, I'm not worried about planners. You know what I mean? Like, yes, it's a shame that they throw them all away, but at the same time, they, they, it's almost done. Like, we're already in April of 2021, so what is somebody gonna do with a planner? It only goes to June, which is two months away. You know what I mean? Some people get very angry that I don't take every single thing out of the dumpster. I mean, do you want me to be on the episode of Hoarders? <laughs> Cause that's where I'm gonna be. I just, I can't save it all. I wish I could, like the hoarder in me wants to, believe me, but rational Shannon says no no we can't do that <laughs> it is a gorgeous day out it is 73 degrees at seven o'clock at night mm -hmm. I'm so excited I love warm weather I'm like two months from now I'm gonna be complaining that I'm hot <laughs> and I don't like to be sweaty but you know this is my kind of weather it's like a nice breeze there's no rain no snow hallelujah so we're gonna go check some dumpsters tonight um the usual places we go on this night of the week which i'm not telling you guys what night of the week i go anymore and there's a reason for that because i have a lot of divers that are local that watch my channel and then i was like oh yeah i'm going here and it's this day of the week and then i'd go to that dumpster the next week and everything was gone out of it <laughs> because they were seeing where I was going. You know what I mean? So I do that on purpose now. I don't tell you what day of the week it is. So, cause I had somebody comment and was like, 
you should really say what day of the week it is because you could be telling us that this is a recent dive and it's really from a year ago. <laughs> what? That, I don't do that, first of all. And second of all, I upload my dives like within a day or two of diving for you guys. So everything you're seeing is real time. I'm not like two months behind. I don't, I don't have enough time in diving to do that. I wish I did. <laughs> that, so I could be like ahead of the game, but I don't. So anywho, I'm blabbing again as per the use. So I'm gonna shut it up, zip it up, and we're gonna go jump on in some dumpsters and hopefully find some cool stuff because last night we definitely did not. <laughs> All right, peeps, big logs. Look at these bright lights. Jeez, oh man. We don't even need our lights. It's just paper. Nope, I found all the good. Plates. A pineapple. Hand wash. Hemp hand wash. Right, we got more shampoo. Bio something shampoo. Sorry guys, I'm like standing on the edge of the dumpster, so just bear with me. Oh, part of a sign. <laughs> Yep, it's in here, whatever it yeah. is. Yeah, cool. Spa room essential oil diffuser for your car. Oil no diffuser way. for your car. <laughs> cool. Two packages of free. Alright guys, we are at... Ew! Jelly. And we got... Looks pretty nice. A cart. <laughs> Grab a box. We're at Walgreens, guys. There's makeup everywhere. Okay, I'll hold the box just thrown in. We're back at CVS. I was here once and got some stuff, but it's like buried in here. So I gotta try and get it. It's down there. Sorry guys, I shut you off somehow. I don't know when, but we got one bag. I don't know what's in it. I seen Rice Krispie treats, that was it. So off to the next town we go. All right guys, we're at Big Lots. We gotta open it. I think she found a good bag, guys. Oh, yeah. Cupcakes. Graham crackers. Come on, guys. I'm going to put you on my car. It's hard to do this with one hand. Oh, I think I got a big thing of soap. 
of dumpsters and haven't had any luck. I'm soaked. It's starting to rain. We found some new dumpsters. We went and checked them all. A CVS, an Aldi's, a Rite Aid. No go. Um, so now there's a new, uh, not a new, but another Dollar General. So we're going to go check that one because Michael's and the other Dollar General were just empty. So we're going to go left. Yeah, left. So we're going to go check this new Dollar General we've never been to and hopefully that one has some stuff in it because we have not had very much luck and it is starting to pour so there's that. New Dollar General guys. Got some little pet shop. Got a whole bunch of these Yankee candle inserts. A bunch of little toys. Alright. We'll take that and then I think there might be another gray tote on the other Sure, though. Was there one over there? Yep. <clears throat> All right, let me just get in. This stinky dumpster. Oh, it is stinky. And it's wet and covered in dirt. And charcoal. <laughs> so much charcoal. Oh, God, it's so wet. That one's upside down. Oh, God. I'm like laying down. I think it's empty. Oh! Holy party garlands. Big old tote of stuff, guys. New Dollar General. Make sure there ain't nothing else in here. Yeah, they dumped everything out in this tote, so that's no good. That's all right, though. We got that big one. All right, I gotta shut you guys off so I can get out this dang dumpster. <laughs> so we're at the next Dollar General, which happens to be the last one. This is the one we got all the cookies at. So it's probably not gonna have anything. Oh, and it's starting to rain. Fun times, and I'm starting to sound like a man again because it's getting to be that time of night. <laughs> oh, let me turn Easy E down. <laughs> So we have Rite Aid and Dollar Tree left and Aldi's and that is it. All right guys, we're at the Rite Aid. Let's hope there's something. It's empty. <laughs> Man, a no. we'll go check Aldi's and Dollar Tree and then we're done. It's all already and just yeah, just got empty today. The muffins. <gasps> so many muffins, all Some the mulch. strawberries. Oh man. The sad thing is I can't, that stuff isn't going to last yeah, for me no, to donate because she doesn't come until next week, which is five days away. So I can't take that food. And it's still raining, guys. We didn't have the best night, but I mean, we definitely got some stuff. Not too bad. We'll go check the Dollar Tree and that's going to wrap around. Mm -hmm. 
it's empty. <laughs> How did he even get over there yet? Well, guys, let's see what all we got in the trunk. Let's take a peek, shall we? Not our best. Oh, God, I just blinded myself. Dang it. So we got the stuff in here from Dollar General. We got the cart from Joann's. We got the umbrella from what's that place called big lots and then all this stuff from big lots and then we got a big bag from cvs and then walgreens cvs and walgreens not our best but not our worst so what is up all my dumpster peeps welcome to the full reveal but before i get into the re <laughs> lord one of these days i'll be able to get through one whole video without messing up my words <laughs> Probably no time soon though, so. <laughs> Anywho, before we get into the reveal, I went to my PO box, of course, and I got two packages. So I wanna open them up and say thank you to the people that have sent me, or the girls, or Beth, items. So, the first one is from Miss Melissa Adams from Lenore, North Carolina. Oh my goodness. She sent me Christmas cards. <laughs> she sent me a bunch of Christmas cards with the envelopes. How cool is that? Look, it looks like peanut. Her note? No, no. Thank you, Miss Melissa. That was so sweet of you. Tons of cards. She must be a dumpster diver too. <laughs> All right, and this one is from Miss Jamie Gonsolin. Sorry if I'm slaughtering your last name. From Slidell, Louisiana. We got a card. Hi Shannon, my name is Jamie. We are from Slidell, Louisiana, about a half an hour north of New Orleans. My husband David and I have recently found your YouTube page and we enjoy your videos. Dave and I have been trash picking for 13 years. That is awesome. It is fun to watch y'all videos to see everyone else have the same passion as us. What you and your friend Beth do is amazing and please continue to do so. And of course, posting those videos. Here's a little gift from part of your YouTube family in the South, some Louisiana foods for you and your family to enjoy. Thanks for the smiles, Jamie and David. Thank you guys. Oh, some Zatarain's jambalaya rice, some Cajun a toofy. A tofu? I don't know how you pronounce that word, but it's like Cajun um, seafood spices for like soups or stews. Some French donuts mix. Ooh, I have never seen this before in my life. I am excited about this. Oh yes. Some gumbo, some dirty rice. I'm excited to try all this. Some red kidney beans. I love kidney beans. I have never used dried beans though. I've always used canned. So I'm excited to use that. I'll try and make some jambalaya. I don't think my husband would like, he won't like seafood. So I'll have to do like the sausage kind, you know. Some Creole style chicken marinade. Sweet. And then some instant Creole roux mix and some Tony's Creole seasoning. I have heard so many people say they love this seasoning, so I'm excited about that. Thank you so much, Dave and Jamie. That was so sweet of you. And thank you, of course, for watching my videos. Now, let's get on into this reveal, which is not a lot, I know, but some of the stuff we found is pretty cool. So, let's slide on over. So, you guys seen this was a two-day dive, and for two days, <laughs> this isn't very much, but, I mean, it is what it is. We'll take what we can get. So the first night we went out, it was after I got off work and we were thinking we were gonna hit it big at that Dollar General dumpster and wah wah, <laughs> there was nothing. We instead went to a few other dumpsters and we didn't have very much luck, but oh, all those planners totally crushed my soul, but I could not take all those planners. Like what am I gonna do with 300 planners from 2020? I have two minutes left in 2021, two minutes two months lord so yeah i had to leave those i know some of y'all are going to be mad at me about it but i mean would you want to hold 500 
planners from the year before in your house? <laughs> no, <laughs> so don't be mad at me about it. But we did get three bags of Cool Ranch Doritos. We went and did a stakeout at the CVS dumpster. Meanwhile, I don't even think the manager was there anymore because it was like 11.15 and that car was still there and they closed at 10. So I think it was just somebody's car left there, <laughs> but oh well. So I got some drinks. I got five of these 20 ounce bottles of Dr. Pepper with cream soda, and those are best favorite. So those will go to her. Three big 1.25 liter bottles of Coke. Five 20 ounce bottles of Coke. Two zero sugar vitamin water, which this is the acai blueberry pomegranate. I love these vitamin waters, but I don't like the zero sugar. So I'm so sad these are the zero sugar ones, or I wanna drink this. But I am gonna try this one. It's kiwi strawberry. So I love vitamin waters. They are so good. If you've never had one, try one, but I wouldn't suggest the zero sugar, just saying. Then we got two of the orange vitamin waters, zero sugar again, a Minute Maid lemonade and one Blueberry and pomegranate sparkling water. Most of these are all gonna get donated except for some of the Cokes, the Dr. Pepper, and the Kiwi Strawberry. I'll keep that, but everything else will go and get donated. And then last night we went out and we had a little bit more luck, but not very much. So let's take you back on over there and show you what we got last night. So the first, place we went was the Joanne's dumpster and we got this cart. So Beth looked it up. This was like a $150 cart and it was on sale, I think for 50 or 80. I can't remember, but this is so super cute. People that craft love these carts. So I'm sure I won't have any problem either donating this or giving this away, selling it, whatever I do with it. So that is a good find. That was the only thing in the Joanne's dumpster too. The only thing. Crazy. I almost didn't see it. Then we went to one, the first big lots and we got some hemp seed oil and rose hip hand wash. It's missing the pump, but you can put this in any other soap bottle and it'll be fine. Two packages of fruit snacks, three out of four plates because this back one is broken right there, but still three plates to donate. And those are so cute for summer. Beth found this $15, um, car essential oil diffuser. I don't think the oils, oh yeah, the oil is in there. How cool is that? You just plug it into your um, USB outlet in your car. Also got some more shampoo, National Series shampoo, hmm, bio expert. So like I said, I have not had to buy shampoo or conditioner in months. So I didn't realize this bad boy was broken. So, I mean, it's still cute, but it is broken. So there's that. Then we went to the, where did I go? Ooh, we went to the Walgreens and this is what we found there. Three bags of Lay's sour cream and onion, one Fuego Takis, one Harvest Cheddar Sun Chips. These are so bomb. If you haven't had these, you need to try them. Um, Chester's Flamin' Hot Fries, one Keurig, um, <laughs> what? One Sumatra dark roast 10 pack of K-Cups, which these things are not cheap, so that's awesome. Three of the Haribo Happy Cola Bears. Two Black Forest Organic Gummy Bears. I heard these ones are really good too, so I'll have to try these. One Sour Patch Kids. One Wintergreen Lifesavers Mint. Four of the Very Berry Sour Bright Crawlers. Two of the Sour Crunchy Crawlers, and a bunch of makeup. So we got two of the L'Oreal Infallible in the darker shades, one L'Oreal Visible Lift in a lighter shade. What shade is this? I don't know, what, oh, there it is, Classic Ivory. One L'Oreal True Match in Warm Light Ivory, and another L'Oreal True Match in Warm Porcelain. And then we got one of the number seven uh, lift and Luminate Serum Foundation in the color Latte. And this has not even been opened. It is still sealed. So this uh, makeup is very expensive. And that is all we got at the Walgreens dumpster. I'm sure there was more all the way at the bottom, but they were still open. And their dumpster is literally right outside 
their back door, which has like a huge, um, I guess it would also be their, um, oh my God, what do you call that? Goodness gracious, words. You know, where they get trucks, um, yeah, whatever, that place. And there's like a huge window there. So uh, I could see people walking around in there and I was like, we gotta be fast. So I didn't wanna risk getting busted and them start destroying because it doesn't look like they destroy there, which is amazing. So I'm so happy we found that dumpster. Let's see, where else did we go? Oh, then we went to CVS. You guys didn't see because my fat finger must have hit the camera and shut it off. So I went the first time and um, the only thing I grabbed was some ankle socks, which this one has some nail polish on it, but not a big deal. Some Just For Men Control GX Gray Reducing Shampoo. I am sure this is not cheap. So, and, and it's a tiny bottle, literally a tiny bottle. Look at that. My guess is somebody returned it because it probably don't work. <laughs> Got some more Align Probiotics. Let's go for $20 and there are, well, this one's probably more expensive because it has 21 capsules. The ones that have 14 are 20, 23 to $25. So this one's probably like almost $30 for these. That's crazy for some dang probiotics. Give me the great value brand, I'll be just fine. <laughs> Nose strips. And then I went back a second time because two employees came out. So I had to skadoodle out of there. So we went and checked a couple more dumpsters, didn't find anything and came back. And I was like, I know there's gotta be more in there. So I just dug in and the other side, which is like this big of an opening to get my fat butt in. <laughs> and I was able to get a bag out, which had a lot more stuff than I thought. Five boxes of the Rice Krispie Treats with M&M's. It also had three boxes of this Great Grains cereal. It's not even expired yet. And we got some Jolly Rancher Variety Pack fruit roll-ups. Then we went to the Big Lots dumpster. And the actual coolest thing we got was out of that dumpster, which was a nine, is it nine foot? Yeah, a nine foot umbrella. So I just have to buy a base. I don't even know. We might actually have a base. I'm not sure but super excited about that. I'll have to have my husband check and make sure like everything works on it, of course. And then inside some of the bags, we found some muscle milk, which a four pack of this was $8 and on clearance, it was six, $8. Uh, keeping with the drinks, we got some berry lemonade sparkling ice, pomegranate cherry sparkling water, pressed coconut strawberry banana. I guess this is just coconut water and some coconut watermelon v8 ew <laughs> i don't even want to know and then we got some danish style cookies a bunch of different uh coconut chips we got chocolate and we got two more chocolate in a different brand some cranberry almond snack clusters we got 11 of these honey made duncan hine s'mores cakes and then it has the graham cracker topping. So a bunch of those to donate, which is awesome. Some Centrum Silver um, for men. What the heck are these? Multivitamins, couldn't think of the word. Five of these Choco Covered Marshmallow Sandwich Cookies. One huge Hogan Ferrero Rocher. Look at the size of that sucker, man. That thing was $5.50. <laughs> we got this huge box of chocolate covered Twinkies. Fudge covered, sorry. And then one box of a couple random fudge covered Twinkies. One orange cupcake. One hair clip that I will, of course, donate. Then we found a new Dollar General. So let me take y'all over there and show you everything we got out of the DG. We got 12 of these fringe garland in the red, green, and blue color. And we got six in the purple, pink, and teal. Four packs of the 12 piece plastic silverware for birthday parties. Some mini glitter glue sticks. Four packs of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't know what these are. Mega Constructs. 
whatever the heck those are. They're little toys, though, so that's a good donation for Beverly's birthdays. This Littlest Pet Shop, this is all gonna go to um, Beverly's birthdays, all the birthday stuff. We got some ribbon here, it just needs curled. Some of the pieces just came uncurled, so that's an easy fix. And then two red bows. We got six of these foil picks. It's literally just one foil pick with some of those stars on it. So another great donation. And we got one of these Disney Tsum Tsum mystery packs. We also got a little three ring binder here. Nothing wrong with it. So that is a good donation. Four of these vent clips from Yankee Candle. They are all midnight or mid... <laughs> Midnight summer. It's midsummer night. I said it backwards. Lord help me. <laughs> so I'm going to keep two and I'm going to give Beth two. And that, my friends, is everything we got last night and the night before at the dumpsters. I know it's not very much. It's not our normal haul, but it's something and I'll take it. Plus, if you look over there, you can see all the boxes. Yeah. Right now, my whole game room is filled because I have... The past three to four dumpster dives, no, three dives worth of stuff that I need to donate. And Miss Tara, she comes every Tuesday. So I still have a few days until she comes to pick up. So she'll pick up the last two dives plus all the stuff I just showed you today, except for the stuff I'll donate to Beverly's birthdays. And my game room will be free and clear, but no, it won't because I'm going to go dumpster diving again tonight. So if we find more stuff, then it's going to fill up this room yet again. <laughs> That's why I'm like, guys, I can't keep taking all this stuff. Like if I can't donate it, sell it quick or use it in some way or gift it to somebody, I don't want it because I'm looking like I should be on hoarders at this point. <laughs> so that is going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us at the dumpsters the past two nights and me in the reveal. Beth and I both will talk to you all in those comments down below. And until next time, guys. Happy diving! Bye! You know that I'ma keep it cool With you I feel like breaking rules On the edge looking out with no parachute You know I'm dreaming about us too Playing around without a clue On the edge screening out With us it's all or nothing Ooh, but guess